Welcome to the Jazz Investigation Series, where every Wednesday, I walk you through the jazz standards you need to know. And if you're just learning how to play jazz, this is going to be vital information. Of course, if you're an experienced player, this is a way to take your playing to the next level. Now, if you dig the series, throw it a like, hit the subscribe button, and don't forget to hit the bell notification because that's going to let you know every time I upload a new video. So let's get swinging with this week's pick. by Mr. G.G. Grice. Why did I pick this tune? Well, it was a leader in the hard bop era. Of course, written in 1953 by G.G. and recorded by Clifford Brown, it had this unique way of moving two fives, and that was an interesting concept for that time period. Of course, it's a really fantastic way to improvise, and this is one that you really need to have in your book of tunes. Number two, of course, speaking of the changes, it gives us a lot of different ways to explore different shades. That's right, shades of minor scales. Of course, we can use melodic, we can use harmonic, and of course, we can rely on Dorian and natural minor as well. So we have a lot of different options. It just is a masterfully composed piece. <laughs> cannot go without saying the melody. It just has a feel, in my opinion. When you listen to it, of course, to me, it reminds me directly of New York City. Although the tune was originally recorded in Paris, still, it has that great, great nighttime feel, and very contemporary, even for today. <laughs> Number four, I cannot go without saying the popularity of this tune. All players seem to really dig Minority, and I never get someone who puts their head down when I call this tune on a gig. So that again, it's one that you really need to learn, and it's a lot of fun to play on as well. Now, if you dig this video, make sure to check out the master video on the site where I go over this tune in greater detail. And if you dig the series, throw it a like, Hit the subscribe button, and don't forget to tune in next time where I go over the jazz standards you need to know. I will see you again. Peace.